Elsewhere, Chicago commuters were stunned. A nuclear scare on board a Chicago metro train just last night. CBS2 investigator Dave Savini shows us what federal agents found on board in this original report. You may know whose bag this is. Sources say these are members of the elite TSA Viper team aboard the 504 p.m. Union Pacific West Line. They're carrying handheld nuclear detection devices, which picked up a reading for nuclear activity. Viper teams were created after the 2004 bombing of a train in Madrid, Spain, to protect U.S. transportation. Here at the Ogilvy Station, they detain this train and search for the person or bag that could be posing a deadly threat. Whose bag is this? The bag in question turns out to be clean, but there's still a signal of something nuclear somewhere on the train. They were in charge, and they weren't going to let that cha train go out until they knew it was safe. Jerry Jones, a Chicago lawyer, was heading home on that train. He's the passenger in the blue shirt. They actually narrowed it down to the people right around you on the train. Yes, they did. And the entire time, you're sitting there thinking, I wonder what they're looking for. I had no idea that I was the center of the activity. Jones says the special security team must have picked up on him as he entered the station and walked up these stairs. Little did he know that a nuclear stress test he took earlier in the day would have set off silent alarms and sent security scurrying. Probably 15 minutes. 15 minutes, they're kind of buzzing around looking right. for this, right. this bag right. or person. Yes. The TSA team passed right by him several times before ending up on his train car. Finally, he got a clue when an agent questioned the man right next to him. And said, sir, do you have an explanation as to why I'm getting a high isotope reading on your bag? And the fellow's jaw dropped. Him. Once the agent said isotope, Jones says he realized he was the one they were looking for. And that's when he raised his hand to confess. I Stress test. Mike, we got it. After showing his ID and Mike. proof of the nuclear test, which can leave patients emitting radiation for some time, Jones and the other passengers were allowed to go on their way. What feeling do you walk away with? One of great security, knowing there are people on the lookout for this type of thing. Dave Savini, CBS2 Investigators. And kudos to CBS2 photojournalist Lana Hinshaw Clan. She was on board the train, and she's the one that recorded the federal agents in action. Nice job. Kudos to a, re a reporter having a, a, a camera right where a nuclear device was allegedly. I've never heard of the TSA Viper team. D is this a false flag? She just happened to be right there, and they're reporting it the next day that they detected a nuclear device on a subway in Chicago. D did anybody else hear about this? Are we not being told something? All out of link. You decide.